Hi everyone, Morgan and family here. There we go. Okay, so we are going to be doing some hand testing today. Um, husband has to go up to the truck to get a couple things. And so we just thought, sure, let's test the radios. I'm gonna stay here with, uh, with baby. And um, so we're just gonna do some testing, you know, with all these trees and stuff, it will um, reduce a little bit, but it's still ham, so we should get a lot. We should get some good reception. You know, um, there, uh, I think, I think you found a local repeater, right? I did. Yeah, there's a local repeater here, which is, how far are you? Do you remember? Uh, I, I don't, I don't no. know exactly where it's at. It's local right though, so that's nice. You know, it's good to have local repeaters around. So is let's do some testing. Button? Let's show you. Yes, button. It's the side right here. <laughs> All right, we did our call signs and everything. Uh, so now we are going to... <laughs> <laughs> now we're gonna go. You can listen. Okay. Oh, there you go. <laughs> she loves when it talks. Now, let me see. Don't press any buttons. Don't press any buttons. This little one loves. <laughs> okay, thank you. Mama. The, uh, they love to press it and they press the buttons and stuff. And I didn't know what uh, channel. We were... <laughs> I didn't know what channel we were on. So this is a good lesson to everyone. Always know <laughs> what channels you're on. <laughs> she, she just loves the radio so much. But always know what channel you're on so that you can get back to it and you know get to know your radio. This is actually a new radio that we just programmed. We have lots of Beofangs, but uh, this uh, this is a new one. So um, anyway. I was not paying attention. I did not know exactly what channel we were on. So that's a, a lesson for everybody. Know, always know exactly what channel you're on, what channels you wanna go on, can go on, all these other things. But um, in general, when you're talking to somebody else, always know what channel you're on so you can, you know, communicate with them. <laughs> the, uh, the trail from here to our truck is 1.3 miles. She wants to go inside. I gotta stay out here, honey. It's 1.3 miles, so she just called and said we're a half mile away. A half mile away? Okay, copy. Did you see the frog? We're out here just playing around. All these frogs are everywhere here. Hello, froggy. See the froggy? See the frog. You see the frog? Right there. Right there. There's a froggy. See it? Be fluffy. You're a mile. Three quarters of a mile. Three quarters of a mile. Three quarters of a mile. All right. Do you hear Ember? He Emma. Yeah, I hear Ember. <laughs> what was that? <gasps> Did you hear something? Oh, oh, oh. One mile. One mile. One mile. Copy. Thank you. What's that noise? One mile. One mile. Do you copy? Kifwa. 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 Copy that! You're at the truck! Yay! All right, they made it to the truck, and <laughs> it sounds good. Uh, it sounds pretty clear. A mile, you know, one point three miles for a ham radio is nothing. You know, it's that's that's really good. Yes, I can hear you. It's, it's a little fuzzy on your end, but I can hear you. That was a little fuzzy. It was clear when she talked the first time, but now it's a little fuzzy. I don't know if they can hear me. Can you hear me? I don't know if they can hear me. Can you hear me, Mama? I can hear you. Can you hear me?
I was like, I can hear them, but they can't hear me. Okay, so they cannot hear me, but this is one of the standard uh, t antennas that come with it. I'm gonna show you the antenna on our other radio and show you why uh, you need to switch out your standard antenna for the antenna that we have on the other one. They can't hear me, but I can hear them. And so they're transmitting really well. They have a really good antenna. Our antenna is just kind of the standard one. It won't reach as far, especially with obstructions, you know, like trees. You know, that's a pretty big obstruction. And so um, buildings, things like that. So a better Daddy. antenna on your on your handheld is going to make a big difference. And I'll show you that Daddy. when I get back. And another thing is uh, going inside could make a difference. He just texted me and was like, or, you know, can you hear me? And I was like, no, I'm not getting anything. And so I actually just went closer to the door and closer to a window here. And then I could hear him. So that's... You know, being outside, I could at least hear them better. So that all kind of makes differences, you know. Good job. I have a message for you. Oh, thank you. Okay, so this is the standard antenna that comes with um, all the bail things when you buy it. Okay, real standard antenna. Okay, now these are the whip antennas that we bought. They make an incredible difference. Uh, it's crazy how much of a difference. Also on this one, we have the extended battery. We got like all sorts of uh, accessories for it. I actually have a blog post. You can look at it down below in the description, get the link to it that talks about Beofeng uh, accessories that I think everyone should have. But, um, but yeah, so this whip antenna makes a huge difference. I'll have a link to this in the, the, the description down below, but yeah. Makes a big difference. So antenna, and then of course being outside will make big differences as well. Like I was inside and I couldn't hear like anything they were saying, but you know, antennas, man, antennas. Yep. <laughs> well, that's why you test your gear. If something's not working, then figure it out. But everywhere that you go, like if you move anywhere or just on a regular basis, I would say do some tests, you know, doing some tests with your with your comms, seeing how far they can go, finding, sure, the, finding the repeaters. Make sure your batteries are charged. Make sure your batteries are always charged. And functional. Yeah, we pretty much always have ours on the charger. But that extended battery really works, really works really well. Um, but uh, yeah, we have a um, USB charger so we can charge it in. <laughs> we have a USB charger so we can charge it in the car or at home. Or, or or you can start charge it on the solar. Turn it back on. Hello. Oh. Turn it back on. Two Turn it around. Hold Here. on, Archer. Hold on. Hello. Hello. Hi, Archer. Hello, Archer. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> <laughs> okay so there's gonna be some links down below in the description go check it out if you haven't gotten your license go get it highly recommend it. it is an online course you can take uh so thank you all so much for watching again just test out your your gear whenever you can especially when it comes to comms really test that stuff no matter where you go take your take your handhelds and go have fun while you're hiking and stuff like that just, just have fun with it all right i'll talk to you later conquer tomorrow by appearing today bye bye mm -hmm.